Hello everyone, MG Tomb here, and now we're back with the Australian Grand Prix 2022 to the race weekend, and we're not gonna not gonna waste any time. I don't know what I was trying to say, and <laughs> I forgot. But we're not gonna waste any time, and we're gonna get straight into the weekend. Okay, this is the new circuit, right? The reprofiled one. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to hear it. We just are gonna move on because we have learned from our mistakes. This time, I'm gonna do the... Practice. All by myself. This time I'm gonna do the practice. I'm not gonna show it because I realized last time skipping practice makes the video smaller. And if you keep everything to the minimum, it keeps the video smaller. Basically, it helps, so... I'm not gonna uh, basically include practice. I'm gonna skip all the way to practice 3N. P1 preparation. So I'm gonna skip all the way to P3. This is actually very boring. Okay, now that I've skipped the boring practice sessions, I think I've done a decent job. So I learned actually something. If you do one practice session and you do it right, you can simulate the other two. And your driver's confidence keeps going up. They like improve upon what you built and they further you know i i don't know how do i show it so basically look at this it's okay i mean i was trying 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 and they basically got right they nailed it afterwards look his is 90. it's optimal one is optimal as well that's something i discovered breaking stability and they carried it on so this is good, this is really good. So we start the qualifying. Manage qualifying one. And I discovered we're really close to the Aston Martin now. Check check. Which was rare before. Three, you'll check loud and clear. That's green now, green now. Okay, so we're gonna send Alba now. So it's raining, just one shot. Copy. What happened? Why did you stop? Okay. What's happening? I think I'm gonna leave it on automatic mode because last time I realized doing manual mode was pretty stupid. Because the game automatically chooses the best settings for you. And we have traffic, of course, we do. Got a bit of tow. Hey, that was pretty easy. Nah, he's getting held up. Okay. So that's... Qualifying one done. Okay, so something happened. <laughs> My recording crashed and... Basically, the Australian Grand Prix happened at... Too much of a pace. I'm really disappointed. I'm so sorry, guys. The Australian Grand Prix didn't happen in the way. But the thing is that... I managed to 
My, the upgrades managed to work and I managed to drop Aston Martin in the race. We're P17 and 18 on genuine pace. We were fighting Haas for a bit, but they just proved too fast and they just throw off in the distance. It was not easy to beat them, so I kind of realized we are in no man's land. We can't really do much here. And for some reason, Latifi always ends up so back. Like he ends up twice the distance back to me. I'm not so sure about keeping him. So, I'm really sorry. The game crashed. I, there's, there was not much I could do. The recording basically corrupted. And this was the only thing that I had left. So, I managed to get the recording up. Leclerc won. We have been lapped. So, basically, we are... This is our finish line, I guess. I thought there was no point in pushing because there's like Mick Schumacher is 3.3 seconds up but he's beatable like you can catch up to him and beat him but keeping him behind is impossible yeah, one more lap yep copy it doesn't make sense though Charles lapped us earlier why do I have to do one more lap Also, I don't like this on the screen, these lens flares or whatever this is. I wish I could like clean up the screen or something, it feels like that. I'm so sorry guys, I couldn't get the whole footage out. OBS basically crashed, I don't know what has happened since the new version of OBS has came out. It crashes so many times for some reason, for me at least. So I'm trying to figure out a way and uh, hopefully I will figure it out. And I'll be able to uh, That's Leclerc. Show Leclerc upload is more. Winner. Oh god. The good thing is upgrades worked. We're really like 7.8 in front of Vettel, another 7 in front of Stroll. We're done well. We're done really, really well. I mean, look at his back. They're nowhere inside. They're very, very far away. The good thing is upgrades or the bad thing is recording crashed, so I'm really really sorry for that. But I will amend that. There has been some problem with the recording. Hope the good thing is I save my files in MKV format so I can recover them afterwards because you can't recover MP4. That's a good tip for anyone who records. Always record in MKV. You at least are able to salvage something out of your video. MP4 you can't recover anything. It's gone, it's gone. If it crashes, it crashes, you're finished. So we're still... An okay performance for Alex Albon today. Yeah, okay. We're still ninth in the Constructors. This was a mixed performance from Williams today. Some excellent decisions and then some strategies that will need a bit of work. Our strategy yes, was the best. they roll up their sleeves now and make sure their next performance goes even better. Our strategy the was... The team is ranked in ninth in the constructor standings. Exactly now as the board the teams wants. Will be looking ahead to Imola, where the season progresses with the Emilia Romagna Grand Prix. Get ready for some fierce competition. I have the underfloor, but it's it's far away. It's not gonna get to Emilia Romagna Grand Emilia Romagna Grand Prix. 
I don't know. <laughs> I try. Okay, this is good. So in just one race, we moved up. So we have to move towards the midfield now. We have to get in this gaggle of cars. It's not gonna be easy because they are much further away. But we were close to Mick Schumacher, Yuki Tsunoda. Both of them, we're close to them. Now let's have a look at the championship. So Charles Leclerc is at 62 points. Carlos Sainz is at 52 points. He's the closest rival he has. Sergio Perez is at 50. To be honest, like it's Red Bull and Ferrari are pretty close. Although Ferrari still has an edge, like in real life, in qualifying. But they, you know, they, they, what they do to the races, we know. Ferrari tops qualifying. Ferrari race win coming up? Nope. <laughs> Let me show you our strategy. <laughs> Man, I feel so bad for Ferrari sometimes. Red Bull. Mercedes. They're on equal points. Alfa Romeo, of course. They have an ex-Mercedes driver. What do you expect? We have to get some points on board. We have to get some points on board. So Haas is our next target. Haas and McLaren, but they're so fast. They're so damn fast. I can't really explain. So Ferrari at 114 points, Red Bull at 99, close behind. Mercedes seems further away. Alfa Romeo. McLaren is nowhere. It doesn't make sense. McLaren should be up there. One development point. Okay, let's see what we can do. What is happening? Okay, this is very important. We may change the regulations and... Mm -hmm. With these goals in mind, we are proposing new minor technical changes for 2023. All the current regulations assessed and we believe many can and should be change to promote closer competition between teams this proposed regulation change will be sweeping the effects of all on all areas of car development so please review the technical break down below and respond as minor technical regulations will reduce all teams design expertise regarding the affected car parts this will impact all teams regardless of their car strength and weakness. so please what what do you mean What the hell? Minimal. Minimal, minimal. This is too much. They're like, let's reduce everything of everything. Minimal is okay. The fact they thought of this, like this article or something from a reporter or Michael Loon, <laughs> and they've written it like this. I mean, fair play to them. It's not a big article, but still, they've done a good job. Okay, okay. So, what is in the works? There is no part in the works.
underfloor and rear wing and it's gonna take time. I think I should have invested in small parts. Two point one mil. We have to invest into the wind tunnel. It's just that we have to. There's no math. So the smaller teams voted against this regulation. And I voted for this regulation. I'm not a small team, I'm Williams. We have history. <laughs> we have so many... <laughs> oh god. I mean, and I tipped the whole thing. <laughs> it would be 5 for 5. Okay. Let's look at the drivers. Let's replace him. It's been too much. Patience for negotiation very high, performance is good, growth potential is high, aggression is high, contract length one year, buyout fees, ah we can afford that. I'm gonna sign him for pretty long. Can I do it for five seasons? And we're gonna straight up pay him a million. I don't know if that... That's obviously not right, but we're still gonna try. You know what? 1.2. And we're gonna give him a starting bonus of 100,000. I wish there was a quick way of increasing this. Are you kidding me? I have to like mash my mouse. I can't believe this. <laughs> oh, I could just hold my mouse. I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. Okay. Perfect! Yeah. 
Goodbye, Light Goofy. I'm so sorry, but you were not worth it. What does this contract say? We do need him in the car. Oscar does not have smoothness, so we have to invest into that. We have to invest into smoothness. That's the biggest. Okay, I think this episode has gone now. Actually, this might be the shortest episode yet because the game crashed, but we tried, we tried. So what do we have in future? There's one thing I want to see. What was it? What was it? What was it? What was it? Car development, new project, research. No design or research slots available. So I need a design slot. And that will open in 28 days. Or it could open faster if the facility would do. How, when it's gonna open. What's gonna come first? We're gonna see on the calendar. Okay. Design center, yeah, that's when it's gonna come in. So it will be after Miami. After two race weekends. That's fine, that's fine. So I'll see you guys next time. I'm really sorry for the video. It wasn't as exciting as it should have been. The game just crashed. Luckily, I'll be able to salvage something out of it. It was an MKV file, so obviously I'll get some... Uh, something out of it and hopefully I'll see you guys next time till then take care of yourself I love you all and goodbye